Yeah, pass. Okay. I'll get the uh, driver out. Okay. Ten four, David. Three thirty five. Go ahead and unbuckle your seatbelt, sir. Um, how do you pronounce your last name? Okay, I'm just going to call you Adam. Okay, go ahead and step out for me, okay? Don't grab anything else, just leave it there. Is this your jacket, sir? Your sweater? What's going on today, Adam? You guys heading somewhere? Huh? Do you know this person? David 336, do you 10 4 with the units we have out on the city? Did you just get picked up by this person? Uh, she was just going to take me home. Okay, so you didn't know this person and they were just going to take you home? Okay. Go ahead and step over here. I'm going to stand right there with my hands on each side. I want you to pick up a foot of your choice, hold it up six inches up off the ground, point it outward. We count one one thousand, two one thousand, until you get to thirty or actually stop. Okay. You understand? Yeah. Okay, go ahead and begin whenever you want. Go ahead and count out loud. Three thousand, one thousand, four one thousand, five one thousand, six one thousand, seven one thousand, eight one thousand, nine one thousand, ten one thousand, eleven one thousand, twelve one thousand. Okay, very well. Go ahead and put your foot down. Why don't you go ahead and put your uh, heels back on? I'll be with you in a minute there, Scott. All right? Is this your friend? You can wait in the vehicle. What's that? She's your friend? I just uh, told her she could take me home by the ball. You sure it's a she? Oh, uh, well, you know? she looks like, but she's a friend. She's a friend? Yes. How long have you known her? Oh, for a few months. A few months? Yes. I just, I just, What's her name? Um, I forgot. I forgot her, her name. Really. So you guys were hanging out at the bar? Well, I, I got there and all, I was only there for about an hour. And then she was sitting there and then just started talking to her. And then we had a couple of drinks. And then I just told her if she, could, if she had a ride, she could take me home. Okay. And she said, okay. Well, I'm thinking that you didn't meet, meet this person a few months ago. I'm thinking you just met, who actually, her name's Scott. I think you just met Scott tonight. Oh, really? No, I think you met Scott tonight and not before. I don't think. Oh, wow. Hey, actually, Scott's a guy. Did you know that? Want to see his driver's license? What's that saying? Is it male? See right there? Male? Oh, wow. It's, it's pretty impressive, huh? <laughs> yeah, I mean, it happens. Wow. Nothing bad about that. It's just, you know, you need to be a little bit more aware who you take home because a lot of people are deceiving and can lead into something else because maybe Scott didn't have plans on taking you home. Okay, it could have turned into something more serious, like a robbery or it could have been anything. Okay, Adam? I didn't know. Okay. Do you want us to call you a cab or are you going to be fine? I'll be fine. Okay. You going home with Scott? No. no. Scott's going home. Now, if you want to go, ride, you we're can. not preventing you from going. If, but you, if you want to go, ride with Scott, you can. Is it, is it okay? That's fine yeah, with fine. you, Adam. Whatever you want to do. All right. We're just looking out for your well-being. Oh yeah, I know what you, you mean. We're concerned okay. about your safety. Okay. Okay. If you want to go with Scott, you're more than welcome to. Okay. Okay. Adam? I know what you mean. Okay. You sure? Yes. Okay. If you want to jump in, I'm gonna give him a citation. Yeah. Then you all can be on your way. Okay. All right. Go ahead and get your sweater, and if you're cold, you can put it on and. Well, you can right be on now, your way, Adam. Okay. It's not that kind of thing. Okay. okay. Here's what's going to happen. I'm going to be giving you a citation to fail to yield the oncoming, oncoming traffic. Apparently, you didn't see my vehicle coming down the road, did you? Well, I think I uh, associated with another right. name, Thank you. but I don't remember seeing one of mine. Oh, okay. So, I got you. Well, since you're from out of state, mm -hmm. it's going to be a $53 fine. You're going to have 30 days from the day to mail the payment up to Santa Fe. Okay. Address is going to be circled on the back of your citation. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. Okay, if you go ahead and sign right down here on the X. Just make you aware. Due to the fact that you're dressed this way, you are a male. Is that correct? Mm -hmm. Is that yes? Okay, just make you aware. Vice is working out here. And if they stop you, they will pick you up just because of the way you're dressed. 
You know, you need to watch out who you're picking up. You know, whatever your lifestyle is, that's fine. You need to be more careful about what you're doing and, you know, pay a little more attention to the traffic laws, okay? Okay. Okay? Understanding? Yes. Have a nice night. You too. In this case with Adam, he's not aware of who the driver is. He's stating he knows the driver they hadn't met in the past. A male goes home with someone who he thinks is a female and they get to the house and realize it's a male. Things turn out bad and, you know, we have fights. We've had a homicide. So it's all about safety.